I just got this box and it's so beautiful. Let's see what's inside it. Are you ready? So we have some spaghetti, some onions, fresh tomatoes, red bell peppers, olive oil, garlic, curry powder, our maggi chicken, black pepper powder, thyme, chopped ginger, a zucchini, some carrots, dressed prawns and fresh pepper. So it obviously looks like we are going to be making a pasta dish. One last thing, before we get cooking, make sure you watch to the end of the video. You just might learn something new and win some goodies as well. So let's get started. The first thing I'm going to do is to wash and blend my tomatoes, my onions, my fresh pepper and my bell pepper. And I'm going to set that aside. Then I'm going to slice my onions. Then I'll heat oil in a pan, add the sliced onions, my ginger, garlic, curry and thyme and I'm going to stir fry it for 3 minutes. So after that, I'm adding the blended vegetables and stir frying that for 5 minutes as well. So whilst our vegetables are frying up a bit, let me ask you the Maggi question of the day. So what do you think is the maximum number of Maggi tablets you should use to prepare a meal for 6 people? Do you think it's 5 tablets, the maximum of 2 tablets, not more than 7 tablets or just as the spirit leads? So the correct answer is two tablets. You don't need to add any salt. Two Maggi tablets has enough salt and it's combined with other common ingredients that gives your food a delicious flavor. Welcome back guys. I bet you didn't know that you needed just two tablets to make a meal for six people. Anyways, let's get back to the food. So the next thing I'm going to do is to add two Maggi chicken tablets, which is fortified with iodine. Then I'm adding water to the stew base to allow it to boil. As we learned from the Maggi question of the day, there is no need to add salt to this meal. So the next thing we are going to do is to add our prawns and our spaghetti. Then we stir it and allow it to cook for 7 minutes on low heat. I'm going to be stirring at regular intervals as well. So when the pasta is ready, I'm going to add black pepper, my zucchini and carrots. Let it steam for a while and serve while it's hot. And we are done. There's the belief that healthy food must be tasteless and boring. But as you've obviously just seen, that isn't the case. That's all for now guys. Check out the Maggi website to see more recipes like this one. Bye!